Hey guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Thursday, July 14th, 2022, and I am coming on here with the first uh, actual update for July for wings. <laughs> so for those of you who are new here, my name is Rose. I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot and I make stitch markers. So please go check out my Etsy shop. Um, favorite the shop and favorite a few items. It really does help and I do appreciate it. All the links are down below in the description box. Uh, so I do live here in the Chicago area. I have one daughter. Her nickname is Carrots, like the vegetable. And we have one furry creature that lives here. His name is Camo. And and uh, he's got four paws. So uh, that's the only furry creature we have here. Uh, so this year, along with the last two years, you guys have helped me with a domestic violence organization that is also based here in the Chicago area called Wings. So all the links for Wings will be down below in the description box. Their website, uh, a link to their smile.amazon um, account, I guess. Uh, well, it's actually your account, but you can choose Am, uh, you can choose wings as your charity of choice and they also have a wish list if you don't want to crochet something and you would like to send them something off their wish list you can do that as well so uh, what has happened here for the, anyone who's new is that I have a contact over at wings and she has agreed to accept handmade donations uh, for the year and but she's asking for specific items every month so these items can be handmade crochet knit, loom knit, sewn, sewn on a sewing machine, or you can purchase them. And she has specific uh, requests or wishes that she would like to have. And the list for that is down below in the description box too. Now that list is also in the Facebook group. So if you would like to come and join our Facebook group, we would love to have you. You do have to answer three questions to join and the list is a pinned announcement in the group. So come on over and uh, have a good time with us over there. All right, so for this month, they are asking for stress balls. Uh, and those could be crocheted, knitted, however you want. Anything that you send in can be however you want to send it in. So stress balls, fidget toys, and worry worms. Um, and fidget toy can be whatever you think it is. Uh, so we have quite a few donations today. We have 16 packages. And I do want to let you know in advance that for August, they are asking for kitchen aprons, and those can be any size. And again, if you want to get a head start on any of the upcoming months, go ahead and take a look at the list down below. I do ask that you only send in the item for the month that they are asking. So that would be very, very much appreciated. All right, so um, I think that is all I have for administrative stuff. And if you have any questions, uh, please send me an email, roselikescrochet at gmail.com. I do encourage you to donate locally if you can. It saves you money on shipping because that's crazy, crazy high right now. And it helps your community. So if you want to consider that, that would be awesome. All right, so um, we're going to get started. Like I said, I have 16 packages. A couple of them are kind of small. And if things are in Ziplocs, I'm probably not going to like take them out. So just so you know so we can kind of get through it. I think it's going to be a long video, guys. <laughs> so, so go get yourself something to drink, okay? All right, so the first package I have here is from Erica Crafty, and she is from Wisconsin. And I will link her down below in the description box. Um, now, Erica always posts a video on her YouTube channel, and she shows everything that she has made for uh, for her donations that she sends in. So if you want to get more information on the items that um, are in this package, then go and check out her channel. So let me get it out of the bag. So I have a card here. On the back, it just says, Hi, Rose. Here is July Wings. Thank you from Erica Crafty. Okay, and I'm pretty sure um, she she did post this in her uh, on her YouTube channel and she sent a bunch of these fidget toys now Erica just remind me if you could in the comments if I leave these uh, safety pins in um, I think that we're supposed to so you could uh, fidget with them and play with them but just remind me uh, if you can in the comments and let me know but thank you so much for making these little fidgety fidget toys like these have little bumps on them 
it's probably hard to see because the yarn, but there's little bumps on them. So I think something that you can just hold in your hands and just mess around with. So Erica, thank you so much for the fidget toys. I do appreciate it. And we're going to get to the next package. All right, you guys. So the next package here comes from Walter and Walter is from Missouri. And there was no note in the package. And by the way, you guys don't have to put any kind of notes or cards in the packages. I will say though that a lot of people are really appreciative when you do write down like what patterns you used um, because they like to replicate what you are doing and it's really helpful because a lot of times I don't know what the patterns are. So there was no note in the package but there is a bunch of these little uh, fidget toys and I think these are there's like a whole bunch of them you guys like a huge pile <laughs> and so what it is is it's like a it's like a never-ending like you can never ever take it apart or or like get it straightened out or anything like that so this is really cool to fidget with that's awesome so here's one of them up close just so you can see what it looks like that is so cool so walter thank you so much for sending all of these really awesome fidget toys they almost look like um hair scrunchies but they're not like you can't straighten them out it's so so cool <laughs> so thank you so much for sending these i cannot wait to go and deliver these to my contact over there all right, they're going to get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next package comes from Janet, and Janet is from Texas, and there was no note in the package, but there is this little Ziploc baggie, and you can see from the back, there are some worry worms in there, and I know there are a couple tutorials for worry worms, so you guys can just go ahead and um, search that on YouTube, and you should be able to find a couple of tutorials for worry worms. So there they are. They've got the little eyeballs and they're so cute. Janet, thank you so much for sending the worry worms. They are adorable. I love them. <laughs> All right, we're going to get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next package comes from Maria and she's from New Jersey and I have a note. Hi, Rose. Here are some worry worms. The pattern is from Hooked by Robin. I had fun making them. They are so cute. I love seeing everyone's donations. They are so wonderful. Stay well. Regards to carrots. Have a great summer your yarny friend Maria oh Maria thank you so much oh my gosh these are so cute so she sent an entire baggie full of worry worms and these actually have the eyes sewn on so I know some people are using googly eyes some people are using safety eyes um I don't know if you can use safety eyes because the backs would poke out but these are all like um embroidered on Maria these are so adorable thank you so much for sending all of these worry worms I still need to try this you guys it looks like so much fun so thank you so much Maria all right let's get to the next one all right you guys so the next package did not have a return address on it or a name but I have a card little note and it says worry worm pattern found on hooked by Robin's blog she credits the pattern to Sam Cloud Tags were printed from a template I bought on Etsy by Luma Hat. I've enclosed two extra tags in case you need them. I thought the buttons could be used for part of a thank you gift. Thanks for all you do and the wonderful creators. Oh my goodness, whoever you are, thank you so much. Now remember, you guys can remain anonymous. You can put your name on the package, but leave a note and say you don't want you know me to say your name. That's totally fine. Okay, so in this baggie, we've got the extra cards and just so you guys know what it says I'm your little worry worm keep me near and squeeze me tight tell me your worries and everything will be all right oh my gosh so cute so I'm gonna hold on to these and I'll give these to my contact and then those tags are all inside these individual bags with the worry worms so oh my goodness I'll show you them oh my gosh they're so cute now these do have the googly eyes you guys there's the little googly eyes. So here are a couple of more. There are, there's a purple and a yellow and a green and an orange. And then, oh my gosh, here are the buttons that she sent or he, I don't know who sent these. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so these will go in one of the um, goodie boxes. They're little buttons and they're so bright and colorful. Thank you so much. Whoever you are, I appreciate you sending the buttons and I appreciate the extra labels as well. So thank you so much for sending those. 
All right, let's get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next package comes from Brenda. And Brenda's from Indiana. And I got this adorable little card. And it says, hello, Rose. Here's a bunch of fidgets for wings. This was a fun project to make and one I'm sure I'll make again. I love watching your videos and the live ones too. Oh boy. You guys, those live videos get a little out of control. <laughs> I wish I could schedule them more often, but you know, life. Um, hello to all the wonderful crafters who make such gorgeous items for wings hello to carrots and the zoo enjoy the rest of your summer god bless from brenda brenda thank you so much okay so here is an entire i'm not going to take these out of the bag but there's a note in here that says what they are actually since i have the bag open all right so here is the fidget toy and it says this is from youtube miranda's magic fidget so if you guys are interested, you need to go to Miranda's Magic Fidget. This is just like that other package too, where you think you can straighten it out and you can't straighten it out. It's like a never ending, <laughs> it's like a never ending quest to straighten it out and fidget with it. Those are so cool. Oh my gosh. And such bright, pretty colors in here. So I'm going to show you guys the bag. I'll show you the front part. Look at all of those fidget toys. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome, Brenda. And there's some more different colors. These are so, so cool. Thank you so much for sending these, Brenda. Um, if you guys can please leave a positive comment down below in the comment section, that really is super nice for everyone to come back and read later. Um, and you know, we should get some more positive vibes out in the world, right? So, all right. Thank you so much, Brenda. We're going to get to the next one. All right, you guys. So the next one comes, the next package comes from Lucretia and she's from New York and I have a note and it says, hi Rose, here are my contributions for July. I had so much fun with them. They were all kid tested and approved by my eight-year-old grandson. I had to make sure for, uh, I had to make some for him to keep. Thank you for all your hard work to keep this going and to all who donate their time and talents. Enclosed are the following, stress balls, worry worms, small octi, stress dolls, and bobble pops from Lucretia. What? Okay, so she's got them all numbered. Okay, thank you for doing that. This was, these are all the stress balls that she made. And if you guys do want to send in stress balls for this month, please make sure that they are um, with regular yarn, not the blanket yarn. They want the regular, regular size stress balls. So there's all the stress balls. And then she says, number two are worry worms. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. You guys see the worry worms in there? Hold on, I'll show you a better picture right there. Look at all those guys <laughs> with the googly eyes and everything. I love these. Oh my gosh, Lucretia, are you serious? All right, number three are the small octis. Octos. Oh my gosh, so cute. I love them. These can be used as stress balls, you guys, for sure. Thank you so much. Number four and five are stress dolls. Oh my goodness, how stinking cute. Okay, I'm sorry, I have to take one out of the bag. <laughs> so this is a little stress doll and it's got little hair. Can you guys see that? Oh my gosh. So you, well, we don't wanna like kill them or anything, but that's like, you could do all kinds of stuff to these guys. And there's two bags, oh my gosh. Lucretia, can you let us know where you got the pattern for these? Cause there are two bags of these little stress dolls. I could pro I could probably do one of these because they're like they look like they're one piece maybe. <laughs> All right. And then we have number 6 which is bobble pops. Okay, so that's in this bag. You guys, we have to see what this is. Okay, so Lucretia, we need a pattern for this. Maybe we need a pattern for this. So it looks like a little disc and there's bobbles and it looks like you can just pop the bobbles in. Oh my goodness, you can. Okay, so I have to stop playing right now. But you can just pop the bobbles and then they go to the other side of the... This is such a neat idea. Okay, Lucretia, please leave an, um, um, a comment and let us know uh, where you got the pattern for this because this is so cool. <laughs> I think I might need one of these for myself. <laughs> that is so cool. And it's soft and it won't make any noise. Okay, so I just redid all these 
baubles and now it's all on the other side and there is a whole bag of them oh my gosh lucretia thank you so much for sending in all of these amazing fidget toys i really appreciate it i can't wait to show them to my contact over at wings and i'm sure she will appreciate it too so thank you so much all right let's get to the next one all right, you guys, the next package came from Kimmy and she's from California and she sent this card and there's something in here. Let's see what this is. Hi, Rose. Thank you so much for all you do. This enamel pin is for you, but if you want to put this in your monthly prize dash, please feel free to do so. Take care from Kimmy. <gasps> Oh, no, I have a whole bag. I have a bag from Z, Zelda NRJ3. Hi, Z. And all my enamel pins are on there. I might have to keep this. Oh, my gosh. It's so pretty. It's hanks of yarn. Can you guys see that? I don't know. Should I keep it or give it away? You guys, leave a comment. I think it's so cool. Thank you so much, Kimmy, for sending that to me. I appreciate that. Okay, and then she's got here a note. It says, hi, Rose. Hope you and Carrots are doing well in the zoo and family, too. Enclosed, you will find some assorted size stress balls. Okay, so here's the stress balls. She says, uh, I did not follow any pattern to make these. Also, a bag of worry worms. They were fun to make. I did follow... There's all the worry worms. I did follow a YouTube tutorial by Hooked by Robin, which she does state that Sam Cloud allowed her to film it. Enjoy the summer. Hopefully it won't be too toasty. Thank you, Rose. Bye for now from Kimmy. Oh my gosh. Okay, so you guys have to see these are colored googly eyes on these worry worms. <laughs> oh my gosh. This one has pink eyes. That one has yellow eyes. And they each have a tag. And the tag says, I'm your little worry worm. Keep me near and squeeze me tight. Tell me your worries and everything will be all right. Oh my gosh, this whole bag of worry worms. <gasps> Kimmy, thank you so much for sending the stress balls and the worry worms. They are so cool. And thank you so much for the pin as well. I love it. And maybe I'll give it away. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next package comes from Laura and she's from Georgia. And look at this gorgeous card. You guys, she made this card. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness. I am so glad I keep all my cards. Okay, she says, Rose, thank you very much for allowing me to help with wings. You know what, you guys? Remember, this is a no apology channel, so you can't apologize for not sending or only sending one or whatever, and you really shouldn't be thanking me. I am so grateful for everyone who sends in donations for people that they're never gonna meet. I will never meet them, I'll never know them, and you guys are just amazing human beings, so thank you so much. Okay, this is my first time I've been waiting on a project I could do, and these fidget toys are great. I watched Miranda's Magic Fidget Toys on YouTube. She made it easy enough for me to learn, then I just started adding my own touch to each one. No two are alike, not even the same pattern. I discovered that my crochet hook is my fidget fidget toy. <laughs> I hope everyone enjoys these fidget toys. Thank you for everything you do from Laura. P.S. I love seeing everything that creative hands make with love. When I watch your videos, it reminds me how good people are. We are blessed. Yes, we are. Okay, so, oh my goodness. Okay, so there's two huge bags of fidget toys. So let me take out one and we will show you i'm pretty sure this is this oh this is so cool i am in love with these i need to make some you guys so this is another one of those where you try and straighten it out and it never straightens out look at the bright color someone is going to have such a good time with that oh i see i see sparkles look at this one red white and blue and she put picos on it so the person that's fidgeting can like play with the picos that is just brilliant. And look at that, it is so cool. These are amazing. Laura, thank you so much for sending all of these fidget toys. I need to get to biz, I need to get down to work, seriously. Cause I mean, I should be able to make at least a couple of these, right? <laughs> all right, when this video is over, I'm going over to Miranda and checking out her tutorial. <laughs> so thank you so much, Laura, for sending all the fidget toys. These are so cool, and I very, very much appreciate you. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next box comes from Mardell, and Mardell is from Kansas. Hi, Mardell. 
Cardell. I have a note and she says, hi Rose, I had so much fun making all these fidget toys, so much so that I hated having to stop. I knew I must if I was ever going to get them to you in July. So there's stress balls and one and one fidget worm, fidget go rounds. All our patterns are ideas from Valerie's Cuddly Cat Crochet and Sewing. You guys go check her out. I will link her down below. She has some amazing tutorials. Uh, there's also Magic Fidget Spinner by Miranda Workshop on YouTube. And then Worry Worms are from Hooked by Robin on YouTube. So you know what, guys? If I can find these, um, all of these tutorials, I will link them down below as well. Okay, so we've got. I'm gonna put the, keep the box right here. So I can just show you. We have um, the worry worms have the little note. I'm your little worry worm. Oh, this has got more. I'm your little worry worm. Keep me close. Keep me near. When a worry pops in your head, hold me tight. Whisper in my ear. I will take away your worries so you have nothing to fear. So we have all of these worry worms. Oh my goodness gracious, Mardell. You were not kidding. I hope you guys are counting because I'm not counting. <laughs> this is a lot. This is so cool. Okay, so I think that there's, no, that's not a worry worm. There is some really cool stuff in here. Okay, and then here's another worry worm. There's another worry worm. Oh my gosh, more worry worms. Okay, then I see like these really cool stress balls. Oh, these are from Valerie at Cadley's Cut. <laughs> cuddly cat crochet and sewing because she puts a little nose on hers and we've got little squigglies on top of the head oh my gosh these are so cool here is another one here is just a regular stress ball oh my gosh I'm in love with these look at this guy <laughs> holy smackerels this one is just plain this one's got a little doodad on his head this one's got some funny hair Oh my gosh, he's so cute. And his tongue. Okay. All right, I have to stop playing, you guys. All right, and then we have, oh, okay. So Valerie did show this on her channel. I'm just seeing if there was any other ones. This is like a worry, I don't know. It's, it's um, there's marbles in there. Here, I'll be quiet. Okay, so there's marbles in there. So you can just play with the marbles and move them around and look at the hair. <laughs> love him. Okay, and then here's the magic uh, fidget spinners from the Miranda thing that everyone is talking about. There's a whole bunch of them. Let me see if there's any more here. So I think that's it for those. And then I think these are from Valerie as well. And it's just a bunch of hair ties. You just crochet around them. And there are marbles in here too. Oh my gosh, so there's so many of them. Some of them don't have the hair ties. Holy mackerel, oh my gosh. I wish I could just put the camera down and show you guys, but <laughs> there's so many of them. There's all of these, you guys. There's so many. Mardell, thank you so much for sending all of these amazing fidget toys. I think like not only will the kids absolutely love these, but the adults are going to love these too because they're so simple, right? There's nothing fancy. You don't have to, um, you know, I don't know. You don't have to figure anything out, right? These are amazing. Thank you so, so much, Mardell. Here, I'll see if I can show you guys before I put them in the box how stinking cool these are. And they all have marbles in them. So Mardell, thank you so much for sending that huge box of toys. I do appreciate it. And we're going to get to the next package now. All right, you guys, the next box came from Kathleen and she's from Maryland. And I have a note. It says, hi, Rose. Happy July. Hope you are well and keeping cool. The worry worms were adapted from a project I found on the site hooked by Robin. So I'm going to show you guys. Oh my gosh, these guys have little bows around their necks. So cute. Okay, so I'm going to show you all the worry worms. <laughs> There's so many. And then she says, uh, the super tactile fiddle balls come from the crafted channel. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out the these little fiddle balls. So this looks like um, 
those magic fidget spinners, but they're like, they definitely do look like a little ball. Actually, it looks like a little brain. <laughs> and it's the same concept. You can't ever turn it inside out or turn it the right way. So there's a whole bunch of these in there as well. So cool. What a neat idea. Um, thank you so much, Catherine, for sending all, or Kathleen, for sending all of these fidget toys. That is so cool. Remember, guys, you don't have to send in huge boxes full of stuff like little packages like this are so so much appreciate appreciated <laughs> I'm having a problem with words tonight all right so let's get to the next one guys all right you guys the next package came from Emma and she's from New York and there was no note in the bag or in the box but I see two Ziploc baggies in here and I see a couple different things so I have to take them out and show you here is what's in one of them Oh my goodness gracious, these are so cute. And look at this little stress ball. It's a dog. I wouldn't even want to squeeze him. I would just want to hug him. <laughs> and then here's another one of those pop it things where it's a bobble pop it thing. You know what I'm talking about. I just showed one. All right, I'm going to try not to play with this, okay? <laughs> then we have another bag. Oh, there's a bunch of little amigurumi. Look at the little bee. <gasps> look at this guy. So adorable, Emma, you are so talented. I so appreciate, oh, look at the whale. Oh my goodness gracious. Here is a little ladybug, so cute. You can squish these, little turtle. I love them. And then here are some worry worms. Whoops, here's, here's the other one. <laughs> look at that, <laughs> this one has glasses. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love them. Emma, thank you so much for sending in all of these adorable toys. I really, really do appreciate it. I know the kids are going to appreciate it too. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next package came from Diane and she's from New Hampshire. And this is the card that I got. <laughs> Wait, you guys, you want to see the back? <laughs> okay, nothing better than some horse butt on, on a Thursday night, right? Okay, she says, Hi Rose, here are a bunch of worry worms for wings. Having never made them before, I set out to make 10, but wound up making 80. Lots of fun. I kept hearing that song, Don't Worry, Be Happy, in my head the whole time. I hope they bring a smile to someone's face and lessen their worries for a while. Take care from Diane. Oh my gosh, you made 80? <gasps> Holy crap. Okay, so here is one bag that is just totally full of worry worms, and these are such pretty colors, purples and pinks, and there's googly eyes in all of them. <gasps> okay, and then here is another package. Ooh, I see Chicago Bears colors. That is amazing. These are some blues and oranges. And then here is the other side you can see. Diane, thank you so much for sending in all of these amazing worry worms. I really, really do appreciate it. I know the kids are going to love these. And um, you guys are absolutely amazing for donating to Wings. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, you guys, the next box comes from Mary from New Jersey. And I have a note here. And the, there's a lot of stuff in the box here. I'm going to leave the, leave them in the box. She says, hi, Rose. This month was a learning experience for me. I don't usually make small or stuffed objects. Uh, me either. I was happy to have an excuse to do so and particularly happy knowing I was helping someone else while expanding my crochet skills. All of the items are made with 100% acrylic yarn. I used a bag of scrap yarn, so unfortunately no details. The stress balls are simply stuffed balls, some with eyes. They are not recommended for small children. The poppers, we call them silent bubble wrap, are simply a circle with a round of bobbles, which you can push from side to side. You guys are so freaking smart. The skeins of yarn are there as a filler, but perhaps you can use them as thank you gifts. Moving on to aprons now. Be well, Mary. Mary, you are so sweet. Okay, so <laughs> here, I'm gonna take out, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what? Okay, so here are all the stress toys, stress balls. Can you guys see them? There's so many of them. Oh my goodness. Okay, so she said some have faces. Look at those faces. Oh 
Oh my gosh, so cute. I'm gonna leave these in the box. Okay, so here's some yarn that she put in there as filler. <laughs> so those will go in one of the thank you boxes that I already have going. And here is, what? Mary, are you sure you wanna give this away? Oh my gosh, it's beautiful, whatever it is. That's gonna go in one of the thank you boxes. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then we have this bag of the poppers. Okay, so here's the bag of the poppers. You can, you guys can see the bobbles. And these are smaller, so you can just pop those out on the other side. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. So, so cool. Thank you so, so much for sending this humongous box of items for the kids over at Wings and the adults. <laughs> I'm sure that they are going to have so much fun with them. All right, we have two more boxes to go, guys. All right, you guys, the next box comes from Joe from Arizona. Hi, Joe. And I do have a card here, and it says, Hello, Rose. There, there are some Barbie clothes all labeled. The balance are 18-inch doll. Hope you are having a great day from Joe. So if you guys um, aren't familiar, you didn't watch any of the June updates. June was our month for um, doll clothes. Um, so if you have not sent doll clothes, please do not send any more. Um, they've already are getting ready to uh, get those sent sent out to where they need to go for the kids. So there is a huge box of doll clothes and there are two separate boxes of doll shoes. Shut the front door. Are you kidding me? Oh, no way, Joe. Look at how beautiful those are. Oh, stop. Okay, so we're gonna leave those in the box. Oh my gosh, these are just so cute. Okay, and then this is, oh my God, these are like little espadrilles. Oh my gosh, they are so cute. Look at that. <laughs> these are absolutely amazing. Joe, you are my hero. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so those are the shoes, which we need to keep those totally separate, like in the boxes. Okay, and then I'm not going to open up any of the bags, but here is a hooded sweater. And you can see the hood right there that looks like it's knitted. Oh my gosh, here is a dress, which is also knitted. And you probably can't tell, but it's got um, sparkly yarn. Here is another dress. I'll show you the bottom. And then the top. I don't know if you can see it right there. And it is so cute crop top and a skirt oh my gosh the skirt is just black you can see it behind there these are just amazing oh my gosh pants and a sweater oh, there's the sweater and then there's red pants with the little frillies on the bottom <laughs> okay here is another dress that's the top of the dress here is dress shoes and sweater oh my gosh look at the little shoes in there this is just incredible joe oh my goodness okay here is pajamas because your doll must have pajamas so that they can go to sleep at night <laughs> here is a dress and shoes so you guys can see the dress and the little green shoes oh my gosh here's more pajamas pink gingham because you cannot go wrong with painting them. More pajamas. I'll try and show you a better view there. Oh my gosh. Here's a night shirt. The flames and the yellow sleeves. Oh my goodness. Dress, hat, and shawl. So there is the dress. Look at the hat. That is incredible. Joe have you done anything else other than make doll clothes shirt pants hat and mittens oh my gosh these are just amazing it's, it's going on more guys dress sweater and bonnet so cute I'm so glad someone sent more doll clothes because I was kind of sad that June was ending a dress and a shrug these are just so adorable I wish we could do this all year right poncho and a hat so there's, you can see the little poncho there. Pants and a blouse. Show you the shirt. And then we have, oh, you could tell this is Barbie. A dress and a shrug. So cute. Here we have, oh, this says Barbie on it. 
Um, oh my gosh, look at the little heels. I know they're not handmade, but <laughs> so cute. I love dressing up my Barbie when I was a kid. Here's a Barbie dress and it looks like, um, like a poncho and a handbag. <laughs> oh my gosh. Here is another dress and it is sparkly. And then we have hat, scarf, and mittens. We have a blouse and a jumper. So cute, I'm running out of room. <laughs> we have a blouse, skirt, and shoes. So you can see the little button right there. Oh my gosh. This says dress and shoes. Oh, it's Winnie the Pooh. And look at the little shoes. Oh my gosh, I am in love with these. Dress and shoes. I'm so excited to bring this over there. Okay, hat and mittens. So there's different sets in there. Oh my gosh, I love them. Uh, a sh sh skirt and a shirt. Oh my gosh, so cute. And I imagine you sewed all the stuff too, right? Holy smackerels, this is Barbie. Love that dress. Here is another Barbie dress. Oh, here see it better that way. Look at that. Okay, three more in here, I think. Here is a dress. Here is, oh, look at this. Look at this little Barbie outfit with the little shoes. Here is another dress. So cute. One more Barbie outfit. These are all just amazing, Joe. And here is the last one. This is also a Barbie outfit and it comes complete with like a jelly bag. <laughs> so cute. Joe, thank you so much for sending all of these amazing doll clothes. I am madly in love with all of them. I wish we could do it all year round, but unfortunately, I think my contact at Wings does not want doll clothes all the time. So, <laughs> so thank you so much, Joe. All right, so we have one more package, guys. All right, you guys, the last box is from Sharon, and she's from Wisconsin, and I'm just going to give you a sneak peek. More doll clothes. Okay, so seriously, guys, don't send any more doll clothes. <laughs> but I love looking at them. Okay, so Sharon says, just a few doll clothes for 18-inch dolls. Everyone has sent in beautiful items. The generosity and talent is awesome. Thank you, everyone, from Sharon. Sharon, I agree 100%. I'm in love with everything that you guys send in, and I'm very happy to be a part of this Yarny community. Okay, so... Oh my gosh, you guys, I would like to dump the box out, but um, yeah, you know what, let me dump the box out. Okay, so I put the box on the floor, so I am going to throw these into the box. <laughs> All right, the top is culottes, the top of culottes is culottes and a purse from All My Crochet. Oh my gosh, so cute. I actually got to meet Norma from All My Crochet, you guys, she's amazing. Go check out her, her um, YouTube channel for the doll clothes. Um, it was uh, a lot of people sent in stuff from Norma at All My Crochet, Pamela at Pamela's Adoring Crochet, and Crystal at Bag O' Day Crochet. So if you are interested in doll clothes, go check out those three ladies. They are amazing. Okay, dress, pants, and crown from All My Crochet. Oh my gosh, and it's sparkly, you guys. Okay, stuff is falling. Um, this one says top, skirt, and shorts. Oh my gosh. I hope you guys can see that. <laughs> and then this says dress, hat, shoes, and purse. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the back here. Oh my gosh, so cute. Here is the same kind of yarn and this says top, skirt, and panties. So there's that, there's the little top right there. Oh my gosh. Uh, top, shorts, top and shorts. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? I just love these. I absolutely love these. What is this? Ponchos and a scarf. Oh my gosh, so cute. Then we have uh, American Girl Shelly dress from All My Crochet and Hat. Oh, there you can see the back of the dress. So pretty. Okay, then we have a dress and a hat. And it's with this awesome yarn. I'm pretty sure that's Red Heart yarn. And then we have Easy Crochet Dress, Poncho and Panties from All My Crochet. I'll show you this part, it's easier to see. And then we have Pansy Paradise from Bag O' Day. Hooded cape, no pattern, panties are from All My Crochet and a shawl. 
Oh my gosh, look at that. Sweet. Okay, doll blanket, because dolls need blankets too. Uh, you know, those ones that have all the pajamas, they're gonna need something to cover up. Easy skirt, easy top and purse from All My Crochet. And it's sparkly yarn, oh my gosh. Dress from Bag O' Day, and there's a pair of shoes in there, and it's got furry trim. Oh my gosh. Crisscross dress and underwear from All My Crochet. And that's, you know, two pairs of underwear there. So that's good. That'll get you through. <laughs> uh, Shelly top, Shelly skirt, shoes, and purse from All My Crochet. There you go. Look at how sweet these are. Oh my gosh. Okay. Crisscross dress from All My Crochet and a headband. It's kind of hard to see it, but it is got fur yarn on it and it's sparkly. Okay, we're getting down to the nitty gritty here. Little Prairie Doll Dress from Bag O' Day. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. You guys can, I hope you guys can see all these. Uh, skirt, all my crochet, crisscross top, all my crochet, and then there's a hat. Oh, stop it. It's hard to see it, but oh my gosh, there's the hat and there's the top. <laughs> Simple doll dress from Sarah Satch. Panty shoes purse from All My Crochet. Oh my goodness. I didn't know Sarah Satch made doll clothes. I love Sarah Satch. You guys should go and check her out too. This one says, easy crochet dress using the Suzette stitch. So cute. Oh my gosh. I love this stuff. I just love it. Crisscross dress from All My Crochet. That looks like it's so easy, but I am still not going to make any doll clothes. Crisscross top, easy skirt, all my crochet. Oh my gosh, the skirts are so cute. Oh my gosh, okay. I need to repack that box. Little Prairie Doll Dress from Bag O' Day. And it is brown sparkly yarn. Oh my goodness, you guys are so talented. Simple Doll Dress from Sarah Satch. I like the way the yarn pulled there. Okay, I gotta go fix that box. Crisscross dress from All My Crochet. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. Dress, hat, panty, shoes, headband, and purse. There is a lot in that bag. We gotta make sure everyone gets these sets the way they are. Lemon peel dress, puff sleeve top, happy, banky, crafty mom. The easy skirt is from All My Crochet. That's the dress, and there are the rest of the accessories. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, dress, panty, shoes, and purse. Um, it's got fur trim. So adorable. There's the purse and the shoes. This stuff is just incredible. And then this one says, a dress, no pattern. You are so talented if you could do that with no pattern. I am so impressed with everybody who sends in one thing or a whole box of things. You guys are absolutely incredible. Uh, I hope you know how much I appreciate you. I think everyone who watches this channel and these videos appreciates you too. So leave a positive comment down below if you can. Uh, remember for July, we're only doing stress balls, fidget toys, and worry worms. Um, so please do not send in any more doll clothes. And if you wanna get a head start for August, we are doing aprons, any size. And you can sew them or crochet them, however you wanna do it. So that is all that I have for you guys. I'm going to go fix up this box and make sure nothing falls out of it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.